Hello everyone. The Public Enterprises Minister Pravin Kodan has hit back at the Build One SA leader Musi Maimane for capitalizing on the suffering of citizens for political mileage. This comes after Maimane laid a charge of murder against Kodan and Minister of Electricity Jose Enzo Ramahopa at the Cape Town Central Police Station on Monday after the death of a three-year-old child, Nehemiah Edson. Godan claimed that my man was using Edson's death to score cheap political points. He said it was disheartening that some political elements were also devoid of any empathy and were seeking to use the suffering caused by load shedding to score cheap political points. Most notable in this regard were the attempts by Musi Maimani to capitalize on the suffering of citizens for political mileage. Godan said that the Public Enterprises Department's decision to appeal the recent ruling by the Gauteng High Court on road shading was about ensuring that the current and ongoing efforts to stabilize the national grid were not compromised due to the ongoing need to balance supply and demand for electricity. He said that the department had already initiated efforts with the health department and has come to identify 213 hospitals for exclusion from load shedding to ensure continuous power supply. Out of those hospitals, 76 were already excluded while work to exempt further 46 is underway. Godan said that the department initiated the work to segregate these hospitals working with the health department as government. We are continuously working to determine what other facilities it can be isolated from the integrated grid? In certain instances, it is not possible. It's regrettable that as a country, we do not have an adequate supply of electricity. This is the reason we have load shedding and our efforts are targeted at ensuring that, that our generation capacity is urgently increased. What's a check on this one, people? Thanks for watching. Please subscribe for more news.